Alright, welcome back to Churn Farm. Uh, we are carrying on. I'm going to just uh, give the other metal a, a quick uh, go over with the cultivator if I can remember where I left it. Which is always a problem. Didn't leave it in this one. Well, we still got Dory is still on his marathon. There we are. On his marathon uh, clone session. Oh, I was looking straight back. I'm about back into this. Still this same day as the last episode now in the afternoon this will be the last job i do it today i should just gonna titillate this up and i wonder if i've got a weight around here anywhere so i could do one on the front of this for the cultivator Doesn't look like it unless there's this one on the T5. Or we could, of course, get one back, but the. Oh, it's one on the T5. I'm just going to swap across the T5, take the weight off that for now. As you see, it's still raining. Water is not going to be a problem. They tell me they have a way above average rainfall in this valley, so we will see how right they are. See how much weight we've got on that. How oh, have I uh, done that? Oh, that'd be okay. Take that off again. Uh, we just say we just titillate this side up a bit, just get rid of some of the weeds. I will need to put some herbicide in, but I'll do that later. I'm not going to worry too much about it smartly, and I really should start on the other side and work towards the side. Oh yeah, there's different weed growth in there, so we just could do titillating this up. We have put some uh, fertilizer on. Put it down and see what's what. As can be expected, not much has happened since the last uh, adventure here. Except that my, my friend and his uh, die is getting more and more fed up. <laughs> um, well, just put that. Uh, GPS on uh, just a whiff. Uh, auto yeah. offset nil. We go around here and we do the headlands afterwards. Get rid of that again now. If I have one, it should be alright. Not a bad little cultivator, well, more a par harrow than a cultivator. Just enough, just to titillate it all up a bit. There we 
have to remember we have some telegraph poles in this field. And what's the bit and I find them? Drop it in and away we go again. The DGA is nowhere near ready yet. Well, it's only been in a couple of days, so it's not really a surprise. But I live in hopes. I need that to get the money. Having to do all the bits I've already done, but uh, I should going to be seeing this straight after we've done this bit. I'm not quite so worried. These are no size fields, these two don't take long to actually do much with. If you thought about it, I'm not probably going up and down with them, but uh, stop there. Should really turn on to the bit we haven't done yet. Sounds like this down it is down. Hmm. Going up. This is gonna be quite a quiet one. <laughs> there are times when the uh, Work is more important than just talking. Let's just don't crash right into it. No, it's up. It's up. Right. I don't we get to actually think about it. I don't think we're even going to get caught by it today or on this on this episode. I'm going to probably have to go to another one to finish to do the scene anyway might be quicker if I didn't use uh, GPS but uh, me and trying to do straight lines might be asking a bit much and also be quick if I wasn't doing the short plates across but there I want to try and finish off near the path if I can. I missed a bit there, never mind. I think I'm going to cheat a bit and go up and down you know, for a little while. I'm careful, but I don't want that, thank you. Oh yeah. 
that's it. We'll do nicely. Oh, this is a bit better. Should have thought this in the first place. Well, we've got these horrible little bits at the side here to do. And I've got to be careful I don't go and cultivate on the next field. Especially as that it's already planted. I like paradise, I'm certain no telegraph poles are real. I'm going to have to run a little bit already done, but, which would mean bad soil compaction, but I'm going to live with the fact we don't have soil compaction on here. This should have done it. Break GPS. That's why I need to keep a careful eye on it. Very careful. Before I break GPS and come off at uh, here and just go round and come back on the line with try and drive to the GPS line as I say try to and I think I've done a, an awful job well a blind man be happy to see it I'm going to do the same with this one. I'll start off on GPS and uh, wing it once we get up to the uh, telegraph or uh, past the telegraph pole. I'm fairly certain these are real. I seem to remember on a practice I, I got the plow stuck on one of these. That's not too bad. I'll live with that. There's some weeds there. How not to Cut off the field in one easy lesson. Oh, we're three now for a little while. Don't think there's another one in there. I think the rest. Uh, you know, we've got like two, three more passes, then we're going to be having to do it freehand anyway. Big thing I find with this cultivator, right? I keep forgetting to turn the par on to it. Being a par harrier, par harrier, harrier, par harrier, it doesn't take kindly to being dragged across the surface. I can't remember what I said I was going to put in there and I forgot to make a note of it. So we're finding something to go in. I 
might just put, I think I've got wheat in one, I might just put barley in this one. Two small fields of grain to give us a straw ready for cows. And of course, I've got to bale everything here. And store up on the uh, in these Dutch barns up on the uh, cow, uh, but the dairy. Oh, no, I'll go a bit further. Put that bit there and we missed. Give the chance to the hopefully run on to the uh, run on to the line no that one is uh, oh there's a bit the last real bit I'm going to do on this I think we we'll try one more pass down I'll be miss this bit here Might be easier said than done. I think actually GPS reckons this hair is a bit wider than it actually is. I have to remember that. Just off the path, or just off the field, onto the path, right. Get ready to break GPS. Or will we miss it? Could do with that red line going a little bit further. Don't think we will. See, we're up to 60 or 70 percent roughly moisture in this bit. Ready to stop it again. Can we get it up to the edge of this or not? I think it's as close as I'm going to dare go. I don't know if I can miss it with everything. Oh, perhaps we can. Don't tell me I'm getting professional now, I won't believe it. Alright, it's just up to uh, that bit, then I think we'll do the headland. I think we've got two headlands to do.
Oh, the weeds here, yeah, well, we'll, we'll spray them and get rid of them. But this, this is turning the uh, fertilizer in. And it certainly needs a fertilizer. Right, let's get ready to stop. About there. Throw it back to the edge and go around the edge now. And actually do away with GPS now. Hard to see where the edge of the field is here and where the. Uh, where the drop. No, it didn't. And where the. Uh, just the pathway starts. Turn gentle, I might get away so it break and the spines off the power harrow. Mm, I think we're going to have to cook down this one. I think what I'm going to do is drive backwards and just do the rest of this now. They tell me the valley is a nice place if you see it in the sun, but I'm not sure if the sun ever shines if it's a dip of the valley. Go on by the, the darkness of some of the inhabitants, I very much doubt if it does. This way and just finish up a long end a little bit last. Just now. Odd bit there, you can see I missed quite a bit. I missed quite a few weeds there, but I think we can live with it. In fact, I think we have to. Best bit here is the back in here and go on the other field. My first idea at the moment is just to get some stuff in I like to do. Pick up the cedar next. What's in the next uh, shed?
room for plenty of equipment here. I've just got to be able to afford it. They're still standing. I always have the dread of the things falling over. There's a wee bit barley in this one. We can actually then spray both wheels at one hit with double dose of B I think uh, it's got wheat in there at the moment oh, we're not in the trigger never know where the trigger is on this <laughs> I think there Well, no, we're trying this one to barley. I must probably put ripe in the big field. It will be not a very good yield, but at least it will be cash coming in. Now, how are we going to work this? Should really do it so I leave some headlands, but. I think we're going to try this time by eye and we're going to start down this end and just work backwards and forwards. And of course we don't miss the field completely. It would be a win, here we are. It's quite hard here to see the edge of the field. I'm trying to leave one one bit just to go round right at the end right Not the uh, ideal way of doing that bit, but uh, it worked. Don't knock it if it works. I want to have some dog legs in here because I'm just going to try and get as much of this filled as I can. Success on the first pass. <laughs> this is where it starts getting a bit more difficult.
got that. I think it's a telegraph pole. I'm not going to look up. Um, so we might miss it again. Well, we did. We ain't going to miss it another time. Near enough straight in this edge out here now. If I was sensible, I'd just get GPS to put me in a straight edge and see to that. But uh, I sense is not my my norm. Gonna have to we keep seeding this go around the edge of this and pray that we don't hit it. Uh, we're up to seventy uh, percent all right. Water and parts of this field. Rather than looking like I should be watching what I'm doing. I can go further back. And by the time you see this, you should <coughs> excuse me. Time you see this, you should have seen a special treat of a new series on the channel. A little bit of multiplayer fun. Myself, Shawnee B, and Boy Behold the Prophet. i uh, trying to farm. Mind you, what's happening at the moment? We're letting uh, Shawnee do most of the work. He's good at it. Oh, there's a long way to go on this field yet. I'm not looking forward to seeding the big fields. Not if I still got this little three metre seeder. Hopefully, before we have to seed that field, it dies on at the moment. It should have the BGA emptied, and it should be enough money to get a decent seeder. Don't think we can go bigger than six metres at the moment, but uh, not the uh, trackers we've got. So I'm not certain if really we could go nine metres anyway on this. Um, Biggest fields are, there's so many obstacles in some of the fields. That I feel we're going to be uh, collecting stuff left, right, and centre.
Well, it must be around a quarter field done. I'll run for about another quarter and I'll, then I'll finish it up off screen, whatever we haven't done. I'm surprised that Di hasn't hit a telegraph pole. He must be getting mighty close to him. As I think I said, I'm not allowed by the armors to touch any of these trees. Well, not to cut them down. They're not going to stop me hitting them. And if they're a bit weak and they fall over, so much the better. I don't know, I have no weight somewhere, I'm probably lost it somewhere in a hedge or well, I'll have to hunt around for it. We've got a slight dog leg on this bit, but get this done. Then next thing will be spraying these two fields and cultivating the that monster of a field. Cut of we've got it could take us a fair while. And we'll get Dye is gonna carry on. I'm gonna get him to plow as many fields as we can. We're not gonna bring more into operation, but I just want to get them plowed so at least we know what we've got. turn into this time hmm. the sheer concentration at the moment F GPS, but I tend to do rather a lot freehand, and boy does it show. I haven't as yet gone and introduced myself to uh, the council, which should be fun if the merchants are anything to go by, they didn't want to know me. about another half a dozen passes and we're done. I have a meeting with the owners in a a week's time so you get a progress report on how the farm's looking a 
looks like by the time I got there, two fields in production and, and the BJ up and running. It's an old setup here, being a private valley, the BGA is actually owned by the valley, by the council and the people in the valley. Turn slightly away from I don't think this is much wider than the tractor. No way. Dares and look behind. this side this time ah success we missed it both times One thing we'd certainly come on here is a JCB. I always have a JCB on site. Mind that could cause a few issues with the locals being a English manufacturer. I would just go straight across here and hope we meet up with this okay. Once the fact there's no other easy way of getting through the other field from the farm, I'd consider joining these two together. It's still a possibility, but I do like the ease of getting from back to the farmyard from the other field. Part of the fact it's rather nice to have some small fields. Should be straight across the other end this time. Hopefully, if we got this right, there should be two passes now. But don't we have? Mm, we 
might be about right. Got this little horrible little bit here to do. I think we might be coming out uh, on this roadway to end up back up to get a better angle in on this. this could well be the last pass this side. I don't think I'm going to bother to go any closer to the edge than this. It's just not worthwhile. Got this little bit here still to do. Oh, well, we'll do the same we did last time. We go all the way around and come back and do this little bit. miss on the edge I'm gonna just leave in fact I'm gonna go up over here right in between the trees and drop it back again here I'm not going to go for 100% coverage. Go in and do it last bit of great demand for corn. Tough. We've got a great demand for weeds, I can oblige. Just that we've done the other side, but back up. Into this bit. And Hope we can get the most of it. Maybe a case of actually cutting this corner off this field. It's just so much of a pain. I'll make this the last bit what we've got left there it isn't going to matter the very devil to get the uh, get the combine in let alone anything else We should take this out back here and we get a screenshot. Just so 
Oh, Pie stuff better. Yeah, I think we have that one. That will do. Yeah, another screenshot with it raining. Right, with that I'll say thank you very much for watching, subscribing, liking, commenting or anything else. And I'll say cheerio for now. Cheerio.